Today I'm testing for the first time the FX61 Phantom with the Vector on FPV. I just launched a line of sight and uh, I put it to return to home uh, while I was setting my goggles and sitting in my chair and now I'm ready flying. <coughs> it's very windy today, you can see the speed that I'm doing is only 17 kilometers an hour. Now I'm putting a little bit more speed but uh, you can see that the amps are full up so I'm full throttle there but regular speed 5 amps is like 14 kilometers an hour not much so I'm fighting the the wind I'm going against the wind there I am using the 2D stabilization so the plane it's uh, kept uh, level and you can see there that the horizon it's a little bit below, so it's climbing. And uh, when I set up the, the gyros, I guess that I didn't do it properly, so I need to keep a little bit nose up from the stabilization to, to keep altitude. I'm going to fix that as soon as I get to my computer back again. 12 minutes into the flight, I'm at 3.6 kilometers. And... Um, and the battery consumption is just uh, 1100 milliamps, almost 1200 milliamps. And uh, I'm taking the, the safe route here. I'm doing a, a 360 for the scenery. And uh, I'm returning to check uh, the rest of the, the functions of, of the vector. I tried, uh, as you can see now, I'm trying the 2D with hold, and that should hold the, the direction, the heading of a plane. Unfortunately, it's not doing it, so I abort. And I tried it twice, and neither of the times work. And as you're going to see a little bit later, the return to home function that I'm engaging now, it's also being pushed by the wind. So... I, I'm going to the left of the screen, that road right on the left, that's home. And, and look at the heading of a plane, the plane is just not going the right way. And the glitching there that you can see is the changing of antennas from the pepper box that is pointing the other way around. And this is the, the mushroom antenna. So as you can see, the, the phantom is being pushed backwards. I'm 900 meters away and now I'm it pushed me all the way back to the water and I'm the wind is coming straight from home to where I am now and now the plane engages in in the the line and it takes it takes 10 minutes to 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 run 750 meters so I have to change the minimum speed of the of the return to home. And here I am right on top of the, the station and I'm turning off the return to home and coming for landing. Yeah, landing's gonna be gnarly, man. Go full throttle again just for a second. See this? Full throttle the left lane. That's just weird. My striker pulls 11 amps just turning it on. <laughs> <laughs> Did 
was there a switch for Actually, that? it did. He's, he's standing there going like this. Everybody's like, throttle idle. Control idle. <laughs> And this is a view from, from the plane, and the landing was perfect uh, with the stabilization. Uh, it's really great, the system uh, performs to the top. 26 minutes flight and 2200 milliamps consumed. Barely nothing.